You mentioned that you're 28 weeks along and your doctor has noted a placenta previa on ultrasound, which is where the placenta has attached itself on or near the cervix. Now, um, usually this is seen on ultrasound around a woman's routine 20-week ultrasound. And at that point, the recommendation is that she have a repeat ultrasound around 28 weeks to see if it's resolved. Now, resolution means that the placenta is not over the cervix anymore, that it's moved, but it doesn't, of course, grow legs and walk up the uterine wall. It's just similar to the words on a balloon. If you look at it before the balloon's blown up, then the words might appear to be close to the point in the balloon where you blow it up. But as you, as you blow it up and the balloon gets bigger, then the words start to be pulled to the top of the balloon. And this is exactly what happens as the uterus grows. The placenta is sometimes pulled away as the uterus grows so that it's not on or near the cervix anymore. The farther in pregnancy the previa persists, the higher the likelihood is that it will still be present at delivery and that a C-section will be necessary. So if you still have a placenta previa at 28 weeks, your chances are great of it still being around by the time you deliver. I'll share some statistics with you. In a large study, 12% of women who had a previa, and it was noted at first between 15 and 19 weeks, ended up having one at delivery. 34% of women ended up still having one at delivery when it was seen at 20 to 23 weeks. 49% of women still had one at delivery when they saw it between 24 and 7 week, 27 weeks. And 62% that were seen at 28 to 31 weeks still had one at, time, at the time of delivery. So as you can see, your chances are great. Um, your doctor will probably monitor you closely. They've probably given you some advice like um, avoid intercourse and don't let anyone check your cervix because those things can cause you to bleed. And you can probably plan on delivering just a little bit early by C-section. But again, if you have more questions, talk with your doctor. They're going to be your best resource because they're most familiar with your ultrasound results and with your situation. Outcomes for babies who are born to mothers with placenta previa are usually good as long as they're well managed. Watch yourself closely and if you ever have any vaginal bleeding at all, even if there's just a spot on the toilet paper, make sure you're seen as soon as possible by a practitioner. Go to labor and delivery and they'll check you out and see how you're doing and how the baby's doing and see if the flow is picking up or if it's, if it's stopped and based on all of those things, decide if they can keep you pregnant in the hospital and observe you or if delivery is necessary at that point. I hope the very best for you and if you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash intermountain moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.